For more videos, visit forthesakeofeducation.com. All right, guys, now let's gonna do this three dimensional problem where they want you to determine the moment that force F creates about point O, and they want you to express this result as a Cartesian vector. So the first thing that you need to do is you know that the sum of the moments are O in a three dimensional system created by a force. If you want to know the the moments that this force creates at B, then what you need to do is you need to get vector OB, which is this vector right here. And you need to do the cross product of OB and the vector form, the Cartesian vector form of the force. The first is the position at which the tail of the vector goes okay if you flip them around you get a different answer and a wrong answer so how are we gonna do this uh, the first thing we need to do is we need to get the position vector OB to do that we need the position of O which is the origin COI plus COJ plus COK and the position of B which is 4I plus COJ plus C or K. Once I have that, you can calculate vector OV by doing vector V minus vector O. But since O is the origin, this is the same as vector V, which is 4I plus 0J plus 0K. Now what you need to find is the Cartesian vector form of F. To do that, you need to find vector AV. So vector A sits at 0 in the i plus 3 in the j plus 0 in the k. So this is equal to vector V minus vector A. 4 minus 0 is 4i. 0 minus 3 is negative 3j. 0 minus 0 is plus 0 k. The next thing you need to do is find the magnitude of vector AV and you get that by doing the square root of the x component square plus the y component square plus the c component square. Once you plug in these three values right here you get that the magnitude of this vector is exactly 5 And then you can find the univector AB by dividing the vector AB by its magnitude. And that's going to give you the univector AB is this tiny vector right here, UAB, which comes out to be 0.8i minus 0.6j plus 0k. This is 0.8. So now that you have this univector, you can find the Cartesian vector form of F by multiplying the magnitude of F, which is 500 newtons, times the univector AB. So 500 times 0.8 then 500 times negative 0.6 and 500 times 0 will give you the Cartesian vector form of f which comes out to be 400i minus 300j plus 0k. Now that you have the Cartesian vector form of f you can go ahead and find the moment at point O because you know it's the cross product of OB cross f and this is calculated by drawing your matrix A, J, K. Here goes OB. OB is 4, 0, 0. And at the bottom goes F, which is 400, negative 300, and 0. So what you do is you do the first and second column again. This is 4, this is 0, this is 400, and this is negative 300. So as you can see, 
all I did is I uh, just did these two columns again right here so you do i times 0 times 0 is 0 j times 0 times 400 is 0 k times 4 times negative 300 is negative 1200k now you go backwards 400 times 0 times k is 0 but it's minus negative 300 times 0 times i is minus 0 and the last one is 0 times 4 times j is minus 0 so as you can see this comes out to be negative 1200 in the k and that is the moment up point O final answer please comment below if you want me to do any problems and I'll be happy to help Thank you.